Hello students, good morning to you all. Hope you all are fine and doing well at your home. And I also hope that you have safely enjoyed your Durga Puja with your family members and also enjoyed a lot. And now it's our study time. We have to start our studies again. And I welcome you all to our maths class. And today onwards we will start our post midterm syllabus. Hope you all have got your post midterm syllabus. Today's topic is multiplication of three digit number. Already you have learned the multiplication of one digit and two digit number. So today we will do with three digit number. So, students this is our first question we are having 321 we have to multiply with 3 and already I have written the places also 1s, 10s and 100. In so, first we have to multiply with 1s digit number then with the 10s digit number and next with the 100 digit number. So, like this we have to do. So, let us start doing the multiplication. So, we have to do the multiplication first with the ones digit number. So, in ones digit we are having one. So, three ones are three. Then with the tens digit number, three twos are six. And next with the hundred digit number that is three. So, three threes are yes, three threes are nine. So, when we multiply 321 with 3, we are getting the answer as 963. Now, coming to our question number 2, we are having 154, we have to multiply with 2. And in ones, tens and hundred digit are already mentioned. And what we have to do first student, we have to multiply 2 with ones digit number. So, 2 fours are 8. Then we have to multiply with tens digit number that is 5. So, 5 twos are how much? 5 twos are 10. And 10 from 10, 0 we will put and 1 we will be carried to the 100 place. See, 2 files are 10, 0 is written down and 1 is carried to the 100 place number. Then we have to multiply 2 with 1's digit number. So, 2 1's are how much? Yes, 2 1's are 2 and we have to add 1, 2 1's are 2 plus 1. How much? 3. So, when we are multiplying 154 with 2, our answer is 308. Now, coming to our third question. Question number 3. We have to multiply 112 with 7. And already I have told that you have to multiply first with the ones digit number. So, first we will multiply 7 with 2. So, 7 twos are how much? 7 twos are 14. So, from 14 we will write 4 down and 1 you will be carried to the tens place number. See, 7 twos are 14, 4 is written down and 1 is carried to the tens place. Now, in tens place we are having 1. So, we will multiply 1 with 7. So, 7 ones are how much? 7 plus 1, 8. 1 is already carried. So, 7 ones are 7 plus 1, 8. Understood children how you got the 8? Yes. Now, in we will multiply with 100 digit number which is 1 again. So, 7 ones are how much? 7 ones are? Yes, it is again 7. 
so when we are multiplying 112 with 7 our answer is 784 clear students now moving on to our fourth question question number 4 here we are having the number 258 we have to multiply with 3 and we already know that we have to start with 1's digit so in the 1's digit we are having 8 so we have to multiply 3 with 8 so 3 8's are how much yes 3 8's are 24 4 we will write here down and 2 will be carried to the 10's digit 10's place so see 4 is written down, 3 8s are 24, 4 is written here and 2 is carried to the tens place. Now we will multiply with the tens digit number that is 5. So 5 3 is that how much? Yes, 5 3 is are 15 and 2 is already carried. So 3 5 is are 15 plus 2 17. From 17 we will write 7 down and 1 will be carried to the 100 digit, 100 place. Then we will multiply. Three with hundred digit number. This two. So three twos are six, and already one is carried. Three twos are six plus one, seven. So when we are multiplying two hundred fifty eight with three, our answer is seven hundred seventy four. Now coming to our fifth question, question number five number is 309 we have to multiply with 4 here children observe it clearly because here we are having one zero in the tens place so watch it carefully as already told we have to start with the one digit multiplication so we are having 9 in the ones place so 4 nines are how much 36 6 we will write down and 3 will be carried to the tens place 6 written down and 3 carried to tens place now we are having in tens place 0 so when we multiply any number with 0 what is our num answer it is 0 so 4 zeros are 0 plus 3 how much 3 4 zeros are 0 plus 3 3 see observe children when we are multiplying 4 with 0, 0 and 3 is carried, so 3 coming down. Now we will multiply with 100 digit number which is 3. So 4 3s are how much? Yes, 4 3s are 12. So when we are multiplying 309 with 4, we are getting the answer 1236 or we can say it as 1236 1236 now this thousand place you will learn more in class 3 ok thousand place will learn in class 3 here you can say it as 1236 or 1236 both are correct Now all these four sorry five questions you will copy in your school maths copy watch the video and try to solve it yourself and more questions you will get in your PDF form. Thank you children.